Good morning, evening, afternoon, I'm Tato Cat. Welcome to my channel. Today we are playing Phoenix Wright Ace Eternity Trilogy. Previously, um, we thought we were going to get Mr. Red White. And I looked up what Blanco Nino means. So, in the text, it didn't have the Inye. So, I didn't know if it was Nino or Nino. So, I know Nino means boy, but I wasn't quite sure because accent marks mean everything. But, so his nickname was White Boy or Blank Boy, but it's probably White Boy. This game, I swear. Um, so, we were, when we thought we had him, he basically threw the Chewbacca defense at us. And uh, now we're at a loss and we're going to lose. But then the ghost of Mia has appeared. And hopefully she can save us. But we shall see. Let us continue. Never give up, Phoenix. <laughs> M -m -m mia Wow. That's right. That still does that. Where? Where am I? The waiting lobby? What happened? Oh, right. I lost the trial. I was hallucinating. Ah, uh, you're finally awake. <laughs> hey, Phoenix. Gak. That's no way to greet an old friend. Phoenix, I want you to look at me. You're... Maya? Didn't you know? The Fey women have strong psychic powers. When you accepted your defeat in court, it appears and that was enough of a shock to awaken Maya's true powers. So. If you hear any weird noises, my cat is doing cat things. So. so Maya is channeling Yumiya? That's right. I am Maya. But I'm also Mia. Now, I want you to listen to me, Phoenix. Are you going to tell me to press tab? Maya never gave up. You can't either. That's what I came here to tell you. But... We don't have much time, Phoenix. Now listen. You've already won. Huh? You have the receipt in the court record, right? Um, oh yeah! The one you wrote Maya on. Phoenix. White wrote that, not me. So. So, what do I do with it? Look at the front of the receipt. The front? It's a regular receipt. Looks like it's from a famous department store. I have to count the zeros. $1,000. Wow, big spender. Item, glass light stand. Date of purchase, September 4th. September 4th? That's right, Phoenix. I bought that stand the day before I was killed. Whoa. Now what now what did Mr. White say in his testimony? It was the beginning of September. 
The week before the murder. He said he saw the stand. The week before the murder. There you go. I think the court is about to reconvene. Go do it, Phoenix. You know you're innocent. Now, you just have to prove it. Right. Receipt updated in the court record. September 9th. 1.16 p.m. District Court, courtroom number one. Wobbles, wobbles, wobbles. Court will now reconvene for the trial of Mr. Phoenix Wright. Is a defendant, rather. Are you all right, Mr. Wright? Yes, sorry, Your Honor. I'm fine now. Let's start where we left off. Tap, tap, tap. Your Honor, there is nothing to go back to. The cross-examination of Mr. White is finished. All that is required now is for you to pass judgment on the defendant Phoenix Wright. Mm. Your Honor, please give me one more chance. I promise you, this is the last time I'll ask you. Mm. But, as Mr. Edgeworth has noted, the trial is more or less finished. Mr. Edgeworth, do you have an opinion on this matter? I say, let us give Mr. Phoenix Wright his last chance. Very well. You may begin your cross-examination. It was the beginning of September, the week before September. Ha ha ha! You didn't get to talk to the ghost of Mia! Objection! Look closely at this. See the word Maya written in blood? Mwahaha! You're grasping. Think not. Look at the other side of the receipt. The, the other side? <laughs> yeah, generally there's two sides. Your Honor. Would you tell the court what is written? On the other side of that receipt? Hmm. You would say a lot in this trial, sir. Ooh, well. A glass light stand. And the date of purchase. Why, that's the day before the murder. Shook us is they all. You see, Mr. White, when you allegedly entered and co law offices at the beginning of September. I'm confused on how the forward. Am I seeing this right, or is this a thing where I'm not seeing it right? The day before the murder. Okay, so it is the 4th. Isn't that technically the beginning of September, but whatever. When you allegedly entered Pay and Co. Law Offices at the beginning of September... <laughs> I'm confused on how this is, but you know what? It works in my favor. It doesn't matter. 
The stand could not have been there. I mean, maybe it's like the year or something. Because I'm like, if it's the beginning of September, you would think, so maybe that year, September 1st, was on like, I don't know, a Saturday. <laughs> And so, like, the next week was the 2nd, 3rd, 4th, and 5th. Um, but I feel like that's still technically, like, the beginning of September. But details, details. Who cares? Who cares? As long as I win. The stand could not have been there. <laughs> well, Mr. White? Can't get out of this one, can you? No, it's impossible. Impossible. Okay, that's definitely a made up word. Uh, oh, he's losing it. Well, your honor, I understand there must be quite a bit of pressure on you. But I think You'll agree? You can't judge me guilty under these circumstances. That's right, I know. Very well. You shall pat- no. Then, <laughs> that is all for the trial of- Objection! Oh, what? 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 Not so fast, Phoenix Wright. <sighs> what? No way. He can turn, he can worm his way out of this one. Oh wait, I forgot. It's says for What fake evidence does he have this time? There's a certain thread of logic to the defendant's claims. However, there is no concrete proof that Phoenix Wright is innocent. Ergo, I would like to request one more day before Phoenix Wright is granted his freedom. So you can come up with fake evidence? I need time to make one more inquiry into this matter. Hmm? Another inquiry? This isn't going to be another one of those updated autopsy reports. This guy's just... This guy just makes up evidence as he pleases. This is bad. Object. Wait and see what happens. Object! I don't know. <laughs> I just really, I feel like they're gonna let him do it. But I, I, I don't know. I'm too risky if I'm like, oh yeah, let's see what happens. Mr. White's guilt is obvious. There's no need to prolong this trial any further. Mm. Well, Mr. Edgeworth, if anyone's going to call Mr. White to trial, it would be me the prosecution. I need a day to ascertain whether these new claims have any basis in factual evidence. Mm, I see. Objection denied. What? Of course. <sighs> Completion of the trial of Mr. Phoenix Wright will be postponed until tomorrow. No, there's... No telling what will happen if I can't end this now. Edgeworth is sure to come up with or just make up something. And after Mia showed up to help me and all. Oh, fuck you and your sparkles. <laughs> Mr. Your Honor, may I go home?
Of course. Thank you for your time. Gah. The witness will stay. Oh, no, it's still Mia. The witness will stay. M Mia? Phoenix. Read this note out loud. Mia? What's this? Mia's memo. A list of people named in Mia's handwriting. Wow, can I see the name of the people? Your honor, if I may. You're quite persistent today, Mr. Rice. Well, my life is on the line, sir. My lord. Highness. <laughs> honor. <laughs> You bet I am. My life is riding on this line. <laughs> I just said that. I have something I would like to read to the court. My attorney badge. See, I'm a smart dude. Um, is that the end? Mia's memo. The memo Mia had given me was a list of names. Many of them sounded strangely familiar. People in finance, famous celebrities. That's when it happened. Stop! Detest! Halt! Please stop! Make him stop! How, how did you get that list? Mr. White, admit your guilt right here, right now, or else this list will be released to the press. <laughs> I, I confess. I confess. I, I did it. I hit her. I hit Miss Mia with the thinker. Case closed, your honor. <laughs> well, thanks, Mia. <laughs> well, I see no reason to continue this trial. Mr. Wright? Yes, your honor. You're done. You've done it again. That was quite a spirited defense. Haha. <laughs> you can say that again, Your Honor. Yes, Your Honor. I guess you could say that. If only you knew how spirited it was. Yes, Phoenix. I know we're on the same page. Mm, well, this con. This court. Finds the defense, <clears throat> rather the defendant, Mr. Phoenix Wright, not guilty. No, I'm sorry, sir, your highness, honor, dad, that is all. This court is adjourned. September 9th, 2.24 p.m. District Court, Defendant Lobby Number 1. Nobody's going to question this. Like, I feel like you can question his sanity, but sure. Also, I feel like that was also blackmail. But whatever, it's fine. I feel like the judge was okay with it, too. <laughs> well... I never thought I'd be saying this again. But congratulations. You're lucky I was born a fair. I'm lucky I had both you and Maya on my side. I'm glad you made it. 
thank you, Phoenix. You missed a lot to help me and Maya. I won't forget it as long as I live. Well, you're dead. As long as you live? My time here is running out. Huh? Maya's powers are still weak. I can't stay here that long. What? No! There's still so much to say! Don't worry. I'm sure we'll meet again. Ch chief <laughs> I'm not the chief anymore. Phoenix? Can you come to the office tonight? Say no. The office? I'll see you later. Chief! Mia! September 9th. 9.02 p.m. Bay and Cola offices. Being here. It's hard not to think about that night. You came. M Mia? I was kind of worried. You might not. Huh? Of course I came. Well then... I'm pretty hungry. How about a burger? M Mia? Boa ha 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 ha! You should see your face. Mia? Oh, it's Maya. I, was, I didn't know whose voice to do because I didn't know who it was. What are you talking about? It's me, Maya! M maya What? Did I look like my sister? Look like you were her! I might be able to use that. Oh, Phoenix! Go to the store and buy me the lunch, would you? Um... Uh, Maya, why are you here? Because of this! See? Mia wrote me a letter. Take care of Phoenix for me. Take care of? Huh? She means the office. This office. Someone has to help with the new right and co law office, right? And who better but me, Maya Fay, reporting for duty. Wait, no, on second thought, let's make this casual. Yo, Nick, Maya here, ready to go down to get down to business. You don't mind me calling you Nick, do you? It's a great name. Mia said that's what your friend Larry calls you. Nick? You know what? This means we're partners. You know, when I think about it, it is Maya's fault. I'm here now. But... If it wasn't for her, I'd probably be in jail. Right in Cole Law Offices. It's got a good ring to it. Yeah. Thanks, Maya. Good luck. Phoenix, I'll always be here, watching, in a non-creepy way, hopefully, because that sounds really fucking creepy. Waiting for you to die! No. 
Great! Okay, Nick, let's do it! Huh? Do what? Burgers, Dubby! Burgers! There's a great burger joint just down the street! Come on! Time's a wasting! Uh, okay, wait up. Wait, you're like 17. Are you allowed to be here? I won a trophy. Clear episode 2. Alright. A brand new episode has been added. Oh, this looks interesting. I, bet, I hope it's not like the other one. Because that one was irritating and nonsensical. <laughs> oh, the way we're like. Oh, there's a whole thing. The moon. No, it is. Things are written too fast that I cannot read them. See you in hell, evildoer, is what I think it said. Whoa! Gra! The warrior has sworn weapons and strike and then something one has fallen, but who? Only the Don't miss this week's exciting episode. I don't like when games do that to me. My eyesight is not great. I cannot read the things that go by. And I change the speed of it and it still goes by too fast for me to read it. Sadly. And that is a bit frustrating. <laughs> so as I was got really distracted by that. Um like the last one was basically this one dude, no matter like it was clearly he was the one who did it. And all the evidence against him. And everybody was like, oh, you know. Because it's like he was blackmailing them. So it makes sense that they'd actually be on his side. But. <laughs> but. Then they were like. Just because Mia was like. If you don't say you're guilty. We'll release this to the press. And then remember Mia's dead. So I guess it looks like Maya saying this. And Maya's not even a part of it. So it's just like this person who's kind of standing in the audience. Or maybe she's next to me. But she's just yelling this in court. And he's like, I confess, I did it. <laughs> I feel like that's against the law. <laughs> like, even though he is guilty. But I feel like that um, confession would be thrown out. You know, like a confession under duress or something like that. So, I mean, it worked in my favor, so that's nice. But I feel like it, it it kind of was a bit silly. I mean, the other one was silly, too, but it made, like, sense. But this one was just silly and long and, and infuriating. So I hope this one's not like that. October 4th. <clears throat> Let's see if I can do the voices now. October 14th. 5.31 p.m. Wright and Co. Law Offices. That rocked! See you in hell, evil magistrate! Well, thank you for saying that, because I didn't know what he said. Hopefully, like, you guys can read it. Like, you can pause the video and read it. I know I'll see it in editing if I edit this video. I might not for the sake of speed, so I can get it to you guys faster, but unfortunately, I could not read it. Whoa! Stop watching! Stop waving that broom around! Oh, Nick! I didn't know you were here! Of course I'm here! What was that? a real show you were watching. What? Nick, you mean you don't know? The Steel Samurai? He's only the most popular TV hero for young people. Young? Like, 
how young? Um, 10 years old? Then what the heck are you doing? Getting all excited. Hey, I'm only 17. That's seven. No, it's teen. I feel like she's saying it like ten to make a point. Hey, don't talk to me like I'm your grandpa or something. I'm only twenty-four myself. Timmy, you're both babies. <laughs> then watch me. Then watch it with me! <laughs> it's really cool! And it's really popular! When they ask grade school kids what they wanted to be, Steel Samurai was number one! I really worry about kids these days. Gramps? Well, the Steel Samurai is over. I guess it's time to close up the office. I guess. And I guess we will see what this episode is about in the next episode. Until then.